countless New Mexicans celebrated the Super Bowl. Most of them saw a great game and had a great time, but some behaved badly. News 13's Ian Schwartz has that from the Newsplex. Many fans prefer watching the big game at home, but there were plenty who went out. Some overdid the booze and then made the dumb decision to get behind the wheel. This driver was stopped for suspicion of DUI late last night at the intersection of Coors and Montano. Officers even pulled a shot glass out of his car. Now, around the same time, this pickup crashed on Paseo del Norte near Coors. Police say alcohol may have been a factor. They did take blood from the driver and are waiting for results. Albuquerque police made 27 arrests for DWI during the same same time last year, they made 43 DWI arrests. Despite the decrease, anti-DUI advocate Linda Atkins says, says those numbers are still too high. I think it is a lot, um, but again, if we compare it with last year and there's no crashes, uh, maybe there are more people getting it, that we're getting the message that uh, if you're out drinking and driving on Super Bowl Sunday, they'll be out looking for you. The Drunk Busters hotline received 58 calls statewide yesterday. State police made two DWI arrests from those calls. In total, state police arrested 15 people for DWI. Back to you. Okay, Ian. More than half the people arrested yesterday, 15 of them, were first-time DWI offenders.